It was Vinicius Jr. once again, with his skillful escape and decisive finish, leading Real Madrid to the European Championship. The thrilling final unfolded as expected, with fans growing accustomed to the White Vulture's dramatic battles. Real Madrid faced moments of Borussia Dortmund's dominance, conceded goals, and paid for their lapses in concentration, yet ultimately, they were the ones celebrating with the prestigious trophy. The 15th Champions League title confirms Real Madrid's untouchable status as the kings of Europe. Real Madrid's deserved victory was marked by five key highlights. Unexpected changes in lineup. Real Madrid made an unexpected lineup change by starting Courtois, who had just recovered from an injury, instead of Andre Lunin, their standout goalkeeper who had been instrumental in their journey to the final. Carlo Ancelotti explained that Lunin had health issues and joined the team late in London, prompting the decision to start Courtois. His stable performance alleviated some concerns in the goalkeeping position. Dortmund's tactical adjustments. Dortmund's coach decided to bench Marco Reus, their experienced midfielder, despite his excellent form, to bring a fresh attacking option in the second half. This was Reus's last match for Dortmund, ending a dedicated 12-year tenure with the club. His introduction aimed to rejuvenate Dortmund's attack, but Real Madrid's adjustments ultimately prevailed. Real Madrid's game plan. Real Madrid played a slow, deliberate game similar to their approach against Liverpool two years ago. Without a true striker, they relied on Jude Bellingham in a defensive role supporting Vinicius and Rodrigo. Despite an unremarkable first half, they maintained control and waited for defensive lapses from Dortmund to capitalize on. Dortmund's initial dominance, Dortmund's dynamic play, particularly from Austrian midfielder Marcel Sabitzer, initially paralyzed Real Madrid's midfield. They created several scoring opportunities but failed to convert, allowing Real Madrid to stay in the game. Dortmund's inability to finish their chances would prove costly. Real Madrid's decisive moments. Real Madrid's experience and composure shown in the second half. As Dortmund's energy waned, Real launched precise counterattacks. In the 73rd minute, Tony Cruz's corner found Dani Carvajal, whose header shocked Dortmund and put Real Madrid ahead. Later, a mistake by Dortmund's Ian Marson allowed Jude Bellingham to set up Vinicius Jr. for the second goal, securing the victory. Despite Dortmund's efforts, Real Madrid's experience and strategic play led to a 2-0 victory, marking their 15th Champions League title. Carlo Ancelotti celebrated his fifth Champions League win as a coach, cementing his legacy as one of the greatest strategists in the tournament's history. Real Madrid's triumph also sets the stage for an exciting summer of potential changes, with stars like Kylian Mbappe rumored to join, promising a new era of dominance for the club. The victory was a perfect conclusion to a season where Real Madrid showcased their timeless class and resilience on Europe's biggest stage.